take it off, let's take it off. Do it again now. We're just carefully wiping around the edge of the air filter box to make sure there's no dirt on the sides. Okay guys, so now we've washed and cleaned our air filter. We're going to add some air filter oil onto it. We're going to do a quick spray over the top. The way I don't want to be here. You've got to spray it until you've got an even layer on the top. And then what's important is you've got to flip your filter over and just go around the edges to make sure that you get a nice seal against the air box on the bottom. So you want your, your air filter to look something like this on the bottom. Now we're going to remove the rag to that was stopping all the dirt going inside. Let's carefully take that out and now we're going to place our clean filter. You can see the edges have been sprayed, so we'll place our clean oiled filter inside here. Just making sure that it fits nicely in the frame. So now we're going to take the air filter cage and clean it if it's dirty. So let's go do that. Okay, there we go, filter is reinstalled, all nice and clean, ready for the next ride. Sometimes the screw is a bit hard, so ask someone to do it for you. First we're going to adjust the chain, we're going to loosen the axle bolt a bit and we're going to do the adjuster. to want to come off the bolt. Hey. You know what? Don't need to hold the wheel, the expansion, until the expansion is done. Okay, so now as you can see, the chain is adjusted properly. It's got the right amount of slack in it, and it's not too loose anymore. Beautiful. We're taking the clutch cover off so we can adjust the clutch. Okay. Now that the clutch cover is off, now we can see the three bolts to adjust the power of the clutch.
Okay, so now that we've adjusted the clicks on the clutch out of it, uh, we're going to put the cover back on and then see how it runs.